I'm Jessica Dean with your evening digital news brief for Tuesday, October 3rd. We're learning more about the man responsible for the massacre in Las Vegas. A federal spokeswoman says Stephen Paddock worked as a letter carrier and an IRS agent for nearly a decade in the 70s and 80s. The Clark County Sheriff said Paddock set up cameras inside and outside his room at the Mandalay Bay Hotel. There was also a camera in the service cart outside the room to look for police. Investigators still do not have a motive for why Paddock killed 59 people at an outdoor country music concert Sunday night. A two-year-old boy is killed in a crash in Bucks County after being thrown from an SUV trying to escape a reported shoplifting. The crash happened on Route 13 near Levittown Parkway in Tullytown. Police say the driver of the Jeep was speeding away from a shopping center with stolen items when he ran a red light and hit two other vehicles. Police arrested the driver after he tried to run away. Three people are behind bars in Montgomery County after a massive seizure of the dangerous drug fentanyl. Officials say they recovered about a kilogram of fentanyl in Cheltenham, and that's enough to make anywhere from 300,000 to 500,000 doses of the drug. Almost half of the overdose deaths in Montgomery County last year involved fentanyl. President Trump visited Puerto Rico today to meet with victims of Hurricane Maria and defend the federal response to the storm. The president distributed rolls of paper towels and flashlights in San Juan. He also met with the city's mayor, who's criticized the administration for its rosy portrayal of relief efforts. Remember, you can always get the latest on these stories and more right here on CBSPhilly.com. For the Evening Digital Brief, I'm Jessica Dean.